Network show done right. That's Firefly. Hi everybody, my name is Kevin from Titan Firefly and today we are here in Lone Jack, Missouri to show you the new Firefly 5Q system. This new system comes with obviously 5Qs and all the cables associated with that. And today what we're going to be doing is showing you a distance test as well as showing you the new clips and how the new clips work by using it on three fountains here. And what we're going to be doing too is by showing the distance we've done is measured the distance from here to that stone wall over there. And if anybody here has been to the Lone Jack um, uh, Black Cat location, you'll know that that distance is about 230 feet. And that's the distance that we measured out for this test. So, enjoy. All right. and we're gonna start. Hey, so um, right now we're gonna show you how this new clip system works. As you notice that these are actually detachable clips. So what we'll do is we'll be probably setting up these fireworks um, ahead of time. Not that far ahead of time because we'll be doing it right after this video, but you know what I mean. And so what we'll do is the clips open up just like our old Firefly uh, clips out there. What you'll notice is two terminals out here. These are meant for more um, experienced users, we'll say. And the uh, internal coil here, it's a lot stronger, more robust than our previous coils, you'll notice. And all you do then is you put in the fuse as per usual. In here. And what you'll also notice is that the uh, inserting hole here is a lot smaller than what we had previously to kind of cater to the fountains and the smaller fuses that you might see in the market. And these are actually the fuses from our, uh, our fountains right there. And so um, we also added here is a lot more robust rubber to make sure that the fuse gets pressed down onto the coil at all times. Because when we close it, you'll notice that the Firefly itself has not, uh, doesn't have an ignition light yet. And I plug it in then it will, just like our old ones. And what we'll do then on my Android, uh, my Android phone here, this is a Samsung A7D, and this will be the phone I'll be using for all testing purposes. Go to the settings, make sure that this is connected to the, uh, the Firefly Wi-Fi. The Firefly comes from, um, the Wi-Fi comes from the Firefly itself. You don't need to be in a Wi-Fi signal area to use this system. And then I'll open up the application, firing device, I'll log into the Wi-Fi itself go into manual fire. And then what we'll do then is I will probably ignite it this way. I'll probably keep my finger away from this. Press the first Q, go down, swipe, fire, and then that will ignite that fuse. And so this is what we'll be doing out in the field afterwards. Um, this is gonna get a little hot, but you'll see that this is a little burnt, but then the new system will also have a clean mode, which will allow you to use the coil to clean off any residue or debris. This is what we do recommend in the future is just by using the heat to clean off the debris, okay? And so these new coils are a lot more robust, they'll last a lot longer than the old coils do, and um, if it does get really dirty, what you can do is take a little brush to them, but uh, what I do recommend is using um, actual heat from here on out to do that. So what we're doing from here on out is we're just gonna take these coils, plug them onto those uh, cold fountains, or quiet fountains, sorry, and go about 200 feet away and ignite them uh, manually. So, enjoy. Hello, so we've uh, clipped on the, uh, the Titan clips to the actual fountains, and we're gonna be walking out and putting it on the uh, stone mountain there. And so, come with me. If you guys want this shirt, um, let me know. So just another FYI, this is about 236 feet away and 11 inches. I don't know if that matters, but 236 feet and 11 inches away. Um, I'm probably going to get some bricks and kind of make sure these don't topple over. But yeah, um, these are how we're going to be setting it up. Hey, so after about, we've done about 10 minutes of work here. Um, you see out there is in the sun we've got the three quiet fountains with the fire plant. I don't know if you can see it from the distance away. It's about again about 230 feet right and what then what you'll see is I've got the um, I've got my Wi-Fi signal at full bars still. I don't know if you can see that. There you go. Wi-Fi signal at full bars still. Right and what we'll do is got we've got three cues um, lit up here and I'll just light them one by one, okay? 
So what you'll do is you'll just tap in one, down, swipe, and fire. And the first one goes off. You can see it in the distance. Either way, I'll go on to the next one now. Two, swipe, fire. We'll have the second one light off. And then finally, I'll go with number three, light and fire, because these are a little delayed so, right now. There you go. I've got about 230 feet of distance, still full connection to its, to its Wi-Fi, um, which means really strong connection, which means we can definitely go a lot further away. And there's your Firefly 5Q test. And we'll wait till these kind of finish up and then we'll walk back towards the wall and show you what we did to kind of protect the Firefly 5Q from, from the fountains. But the good thing is, again, these clips are removable and they'll be really, really cost efficient to repurchase if something does happen to the clip itself. So now that the last one is kind of dying down, we'll walk towards the, uh, the fountain. The thing is, um, on my phone right now, I can still see that all three have lit up green, which means that the clips themselves have not been damaged in a way where we have uh, interrupted continuity. And that's actually really important to notice as you approach this smoke cloud. So as we can see, that after these have ignited, uh, the clips fell down. These are all still usable, right? They're a little dirty, but again, all I have to do is tap, swipe, fire, and I'll clean them a little bit. And you see the glow red hot again. That's one. Second one, dirty again. Swipe, fire, clean them off. That light again. Last one, swipe, fire. That might take another one just to clean off. And we're good. And what we've done here is he can show you too that the firefly is sitting actually below this wood plate just to protect it from, you know, this. All right, and we have some paper here just in case as well. So uh, successful test in Lone Jack, Missouri with the 5Q, distance test, cable test, and um, Android test really. So I uh, hope everybody enjoys and I'll see you guys out there.